Come out and get beat by this crazy team, supposedly crazy team, and ended up picking off twice. And that second one, I was like, I didn't even know. And I was like, oh my gosh, I got it again. I mean, there was a lot of energy, you know, especially since our offense was rolling, you know, and we thought we could really shut them down. Uh, they scored a bunch of points against uh, Cedar Grove, so we definitely felt like that we had to try to contain that. And uh, uh, we were fortunate enough to be able to do that this week. Did y'all feel like you kind of had this game on your shoulders as a defensive unit when you came in? Uh, yes, sir. I do feel like it. I mean, when you put up 40 points against Cedar Grove, I mean, you're a good football team. So we were, uh, you know, we really worked during the week you know, weight room, film, especially on the practice field to get ready for that offense? Well, you know, our offense did a good job of time management. Uh, we picked up first downs and probably one of the biggest benefits to a good defense is having an offense that keeps the ball. And we were able to have 43 yards, 43 times rushing and 18 passes. And, and I think our defense played 16 plays in the first half. Playoffs in general, you're already fired up and ready to go. And especially when the defense makes a big play like that, the offense gets to come out and make another chance without having to get kicked off or punt. Obviously, you can look at our records and see that we we struggled because uh, uh, we had a lot of young guys. But they, you know, we have learned the system. They're getting better each week, and and uh, giving us an opportunity to keep on playing. We're going to game 12. I mean, we went from you know a team of just people that got put together in reality to a real unit you know, a real brotherhood of uh, players. So, I mean, it's been really cool to see. Really matured as a team, and now we've had so much experience now together that really just clicked. Their edge is basically team chemistry. You know, team, I always say, you know, it's like lightning in a jar. When you got guys who like each other and play hard together and do their job, then, then you have an opportunity. I think the, uh, the want, the mentality, you know, just go out there, do your job, and have fun with it, you know, and hit hard. I think the coaches and I think the drive, especially since we were told that we weren't going to go very far or be very good, that we wanted to show up and make, you know, show everyone that that's wrong. You know, we always have a chip on our shoulder. I mean, we were put to be fifth place in our region. We weren't even supposed to be here. So, I mean, it's a really big chip on our shoulder. Well, you know, we're very fortunate since I've been here seven years. I've uh, been able to get in the playoffs all seven. and. Six out of those seven be able to get through round two, and uh, I knew this is probably one of the biggest challenges we had to to get to the second round. And uh, you know, it was like all three phases. It was a, a team effort to get here.